Hello friends, welcome back to edupediaword.com, your destination to free online education. In the previous video, we have discussed the section formula that is, if we have a line segment AB with these coordinates of the terminal points and PXY is a point which divides the line segment AB in a ratio M1 ratio M2 then according to section formula the coordinates of P are given as M1 X2 plus M2 X1 over M1 plus M2 comma M1 Y2 plus M2 Y1 over M1 plus M2 this is the X coordinate and this is the Y coordinate of P now let us discuss some questions on this formula in the first question we are asked to find the coordinates of a point which divides the line segment joining the points these two points are given in ratio 2 ratio 1 internally so we have a line segment which joins the points 1 comma 2 and 7 comma 5 the word internally means that the point which divides this, this line segment that is let us say it be AB is located on this line AB if it is said that the point divides this line externally then the point P is located on the extended version of AB that is outside the actual line segment AB somewhere over here the point P for such a case that is for external case will be collinear with B and A but it will be located external to AB now in our case we are given with the internal division so let us deal with it we are given that the ratio in which the P divides AP is 2 ratio 1 so in actual this point will be somewhere over here that is AP will be slightly larger than PB that is P will be close to B so let us have the formula first of all the formula is given as px comma y is m1 x2 plus m2 x1 over m1 plus m2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 over m1 plus m2 where x1 comma y1 let us denote the coordinates of a by x1 comma y1 and let us denote the coordinates of b by x2 comma y2 and let us denote the coordinates of p by x comma y and let this ratio be m1 ratio m2 so on substituting different values in this formula we will get px comma y as m1 ratio m2 is 2 ratio 1 that is m1 over m2 is 2 by 1 so m1 will correspond to 2 and x2 is 5 7 plus m2 is 1 x1 is 1 over m1 plus m2 that is 2 plus 1 similarly we have 2 into y2 that is 5 plus 1 into y1 that is 2 over 2 plus 1 so all in all we get 14 plus 1 15 over 3 comma 10 plus 2 12 over 3 that is px comma y is this value or on solving this value we have 5 comma 4 so the required coordinates of the point p are 5 comma 4 Now let us have second question. Here we need to find AP ratio PB. 
where the coordinates of A, B and P are given and we need to find the ratio. Let us denote this ratio as M1 ratio M2. Now let this point A be denoted by x1, y1, the point B by x2, y2. So as to simplify the values for substitution, let this point P be denoted by x, y. So the formula for this point P, that is the section formula is given as m1 x2 plus m2 x1 over m1 plus m2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 over m1 plus m2. Thus, on substituting different values, we have 7, 3, that is x, y is equal to m1 x2, that is 8, plus m2 into x1, which is 4, over m1 plus m2, comma, m1 y2 plus m2 y1 that is minus 3 over m1 plus m2 so on further simplifying this expression we have 7 equal to 8 m1 plus 4 m2 over m1 plus m2 and 3 is equal to 5 m1 minus 3 m2 over m1 plus m2 Friends, to simplify these two expressions, let us divide both numerator and denominator on both the expressions. In both the expressions, now to simplify these two equations, let us divide numerator and denominator. by m2 on RHS. So we will get 7 is equal to 8 m1 over m2 plus 4 over m1 over m2 plus 1 and in this equation, we will get 3 is equal to 5 m1 over m2 minus 3 over m1 over m2 plus 1. Now let us denote the value m1 over m2 by k. Thus, we will get 7 is equal to 8k plus 4 over k plus 1 that is 7k plus 7 is equal to 8k plus 4 or k is equal to 3. Similarly, here we will get 3 is equal to 5k minus 3 over k plus 1 that is 3k plus 3 is equal to 5k minus 3 or 2k is equal to 6 implies that k is equal to 3. Now k was m1 over m2 Thus, we can say that k by 1 is equal to 3 by 1 or m1 over m2 is equal to 3 by 1 which means that m1 ratio m2 is equal to 3 ratio 1 is the desired ratio. Now, let us have another question. Here, we need to find the coordinates of P and Q if P and Q are the points of trisection of AB. So we have a line segment and its coordinates of the terminal points. Friends, by trisection we mean that AP is equal to PQ is equal to QB. That is P and Q divides the line segment AB in three equal parts. So we can say that P individually divides AB in 
वन रेशियो टू इंटरनली वाई बिकॉज ऑल दीज पार्ट आर इक्वल सो ए पी रेशियो पी बी दैट इज दिस पार्ट रेशियो दिस combination of the two parts will be 1 ratio 2 now let us denote the coordinates of a by x1 comma y1 and those of b by x2 comma y2 and this ratio let it be m1 ratio m2 so we have by section formula if the coordinates of point p be denoted by p x comma y we will have m1 that is 1 into x2 that is 5 plus m2 that is 2 into x1 that is minus 1 over m1 plus m2 similarly for the other coordinate we will have m1 into y2 plus m2 into y1 over m1 plus m2 which will give us 5 minus 2 over 3 comma minus 9 plus 6 over 3 that is 3 by 3 comma minus 3 by 3 which is nothing but 1 comma minus 1 so the coordinates of point p are 1 comma minus 1 similarly we can proceed for the point q we can say that q divides ab in the ratio 2 ratio 1 internally because aq ratio qb will be 2 ratio 1 that is this combination ratio this part qb so again by section formula if we denote the coordinates of q by x comma y then we will have its value as M1 that is 2 multiplied by x2 that is 5 plus 1 into minus 1 over 2 plus 1. Simply we need to substitute the value of 2 in place of this 1 and 1 in place of this 2 in the formula for p because 1 ratio 2 has been changed to 2 ratio 1 here. So just by comparing. the y coordinate can also be written as 2 into -9 plus 1 into 3 over 1 plus 2 sorry 2 plus 1 because m1 of q is m2 of p so on solving we will get 10 minus 1 over 3 comma -18 plus 3 over 3 thus we have 9 over 3 comma minus 15 over 3 which is 3 comma minus 5 so the coordinates of q are 3 comma minus 5 and hence both the coordinates that is coordinates of p and q are 1 comma minus 1 and 3 comma minus 5 respectively now friends let us discuss the last question here we are asked to find the ratio in which the y axis divides the line segment joining the points p and q also we need to find the point of intersection so all in all two things are asked the ratio and the point of intersection let us first have a rough idea of how the line segment joining p and q is located on the coordinate axis Minus two comma six will be roughly here, whereas four comma three will roughly be here. So this is a rough representation of the line segment PQ. Now y-axis is dividing. the line segment pq at this point let this point be a and 
its coordinates be x comma y we need to find the ratio pa is to aq and also the coordinates x comma y of the point of intersection a so let these coordinates of point p be denoted by x1 comma y1 and the coordinates of point q be denoted by x2 comma y2 thus if the ratio pa is to aq is let us say m1 ratio m2 then by section formula we can say that coordinates of point a that is x comma y are m1 into x2 that is 4 plus m2 into x1 that is minus 2 over m1 plus m2 similarly for y we have m1 into y2 plus m2 into y1 over m1 plus m2 now friends since the point A is on y-axis for every point on y-axis the x-coordinate is 0 so for A also x will be 0 thus we can replace this x by 0 so on comparing the coordinates we can say that 0 is equal to 4m1 minus 2m2 over m1 plus m2 and y is equal to 3m1 plus 6m2 over m1 plus m2 so on cross multiplying this equation we will have 0 is equal to 4m1 minus 2m2 that is 4m1 is equal to 2m2 or simply m1 over m2 is equal to 2 over 4 or 1 by 2 thus m1 ratio m2 is 1 ratio 2 so the ratio is 1 ratio 2 now to find out the value of y just put this m1 ratio m2 in this equation so we have y is equal to 3 m1 is 1 plus 6 into 2 over 1 plus 2 that is 12 plus 3 15 over 3 or simply 5 so the coordinates of point a are 0 comma 5 thus the ratio is 1 ratio 2 and the coordinates of the point of intersection are 0 comma 5 so friends that's all in this video thanks friends for watching edupedia word videos